Punjabi and English scholar, poet and intellectual Mushtaq Sufi's commentary on Shorta G. Milodi's book. This book review was published in the Daily Dawn, Lahore on May 30, 2022. Now listen to the commentary on the book. Shaguf to Gimme Lodi's latest book Cancer Teodi and Kisman has been published by Fiction House, Lahore. Surprised? Composing medical treatises has been part of Punjab's literary culture. Such treatises weren't uncommon till the 19th century. The texts were usually found in the form of poetry if one can call them so. Kermanuk, Healthy Humans, for example, is one of the highly celebrated books on the subject of diseases and their treatment. It reads like good poetry. The title itself is poetic. And Punjabi writers can learn a thing or two about from the author how to use language for non-literary content with literary effect. Shagufta Gimi, the daughter of reputable Punjabi writer and broadcaster late Salim Khan Gimi, is an author, broadcaster, educationist and researcher. She is also involved in philanthropic work. She is a kind of rare human being who performs whatever she undertakes with skill and elan. Full of verve and vitality, she is capable of inspiring even the most dispirited. Her book is an ample evidence of her concern for fellow human beings and life. Acknowledging that it's not her original research, she points at the very outset, I took the stuff from Canadian Cancer website and, several other relevant websites and English language articles. The book is purely for public benefit and pro bono work. The book provides general information based on medical research for several types of cancer. Shagufta cautiously writes in the preface, According to my knowledge this book is one of a kind in Sharmaki script, Arabic-based script used in the West Punjab, which provides basic information about 19 types of cancer. Please remember this information is not substitute for medical advice. It is meant for lay readers. The language used by her is not verbose and obscure. It's rather simple. The smooth flow of the text makes it accessible thus making it very useful for the cancer patients and families and their attendants. The book has 29 chapters comprising 442 pages. It also contains illustrations, sketches and diagrams for demonstrative purposes. It is labor of love and shows author's concern for suffering humans. Her obvious compassion is for common people who she wants to help by providing them with information in their own language. All libraries and every household must have this book so that equipped with medical information we are better able to the fight the cancer that is on the rise in the country. The deadly disease inflicts unbearable pain on the patients and its treatment involves a huge strain on financial resources. So why is it to emphasize the awareness? Shagufta's book also helps us enlighten on preventive medicine. A highly valuable addition to the small repertoire of medical literature we have in Punjabi.